you look at the last you know minute of that game, and where does it rank in the craziest finishes that you've ever played in? Well, probably top one or top two. You know, I've never been anything like that, but. You know, as long as you live in the moment and take advantage of it, it was a fun moment now looking back on it right now, but it was stressful in the moment. But, you know, staying ready in those moments, and that's probably top three for me. I've never had anything like that, but you just got to be ready for everything. What uh, what are your nerves when the fumble happens and you got to go back on the field? Uh, there's no nerves on our side of the ball. You know, we're just ready to go back out at any moment. Uh, it's called being ready. Our coaches do a great job of making sure we're ready at all moments. So there was no nerves. It was going out there and let's handle business and do what we're supposed to do. What did you see on that play? I mean, it kind of looked like Scott was almost, you know, that you guys were reading that pretty well of like, hey, this is a pass play. Is that what you – What's yeah, happening? so Scott and them do a great job of front helping us out yeah. and realizing things like that. But we also have things in our back end where we know where Tennessee is coming. And uh, right there, they just had their best receiver lined up at two. And, you know, that's on the safety. They like that matchup. And, you know, I knew the ball was coming to me and just locked into my technique, turned around, made a play, and, you know, that was it. But Scott and those guys at D-line, everybody, we are usually very in tune and when we know party and Army. So those guys do a great job, and I appreciate them for that. A couple months ago, you guys were 2-2. Two and two. Now you're heading to the Mountain West Championship game. What does that say about this team? We, we finish. We, we fight. We, uh, we're resilient. We don't let anything bother us, and we just, we're just we a very tight-knit family right now. We know that's us against everybody, and that's how we're going to approach each game. And, you know, we just we just fight through everything. That's a team of fighters in there, and I appreciate them more than anything anything in the world right now and more than they ever know, and we're just fighting. We're just going to keep fighting, keep swinging until we can't no more. The uh, They completed three passes, had three interceptions. What, uh, what made you guys so effective tonight in, in stopping the pass? Well, it's really coming down to those guys up front, you know, winning first and second down and then having them get in those type of situations where it's a little harder to convert. So those guys up front, those front seven guys doing a great job of killing the first down runs, killing the second down runs, and allowing us DBs to get into our our profession, our technique now and help them out. So, you know, everybody played well tonight. Everybody played great together, and that's just what happens on those type of things. That's why you get those third downs like that. Everybody has to be in tune. Everybody has to play together. What did you think of Taylor Green tonight? Just another off, awesome, uh, confident drive to take the lead. Uh, I, I love Taylor. He's growing. He's growing every week. He's growing as a man, as a player. And you know, I'm just, I'm just excited to see him continue to grow. Uh, I love watching the growth of him right now, just every week about how he handles his business. So, you know, Taylor stepping in that moment. Uh, you know, it's hard. You know, it's hard for a quarterback, especially a young guy, to be able to step in that moment and be so calm and just deliver. So credits to him, credits to Coach Cutter, credits to the whole offense for making everything so easy. Yes, sir. How tough is it to play when it's just freezing like that? Uh, it's, it's, of course, it's going to be tough. You know, you have to be mentally strong. But well, at the end of the day, you're here to do a job. You know what you signed up for when you play football. So you sign up for games like this, and you can't really just let that affect you. You have to come out still act like you're not cold and just get warmed up and continue to play and fight because that's what we do at the end of the day. We're football players. We play and stuff like this. You, uh, you, oh, sorry. Your, your senior year, uh, for you personally, what does it mean to you to have a chance to end your career with the Mountain West Championship? Uh, that's one of the main reasons why I came back, you know. Uh, everything's going to plan right now. We still got to finish, but it's just great to see that everything that we worked so hard for be able to come into fruition, basically, and just come into real life, but we're not done yet. We, we we just wanted this game to get us there. We know we're not done yet. We still have a mission to accomplish. So, what did it feel like for you with that last interception, knowing that that pretty much sealed the game, secured the win? Oh, uh, it felt great. You know, uh, it, you gotta be ready for those moments and be ready for that time. And I was just great to be able to make that play and just end the game and have us get out of here with a win and be able to go celebrate with my teammates, celebrate with the coaches because we all put in so much work for it. So that time right there was just me to be there and make that play, and I did it. And you know, credit to the coach, credit to everybody else, because without them, I wouldn't have been in that position. Pee Wee, Pop Warner, high school, anything. Have you ever had two interceptions in a minute and whatever that was? Now, I've never had it. I've had them in games before, but never in a minute like that. I mean, honestly, I didn't even realize it was that close. I was just out there playing. So I've never had anything like that. So it was pretty cool. I kept my gloves for it. So, you know. <laughs> cool. All right. Thank you. Awesome. Thanks, Jalen. Thanks, Jalen.